Hey, Steve here from Vegas Westside Shooters. Uh, we're going to do a quick video today on uh, the Aguila 12-gauge uh, uh, mini shells. Uh, these are uh, basically one and three-quarter inch uh, shotgun shells in 12-gauge, and uh, we're interested to see if this is going to work in our uh, DP-12 double-barrel pump-action shotgun, uh, whether these can feed or not. The manual on the DP-12 uh, does not prohibit using shorter shells, uh, but it does caution that they may or may not work. Uh, so we're going to try, uh, we've got a couple, we've got these. Um, the first ones are these, uh, these are buckshot, and uh, there's 20 in here. Let me show you these, they're so cute. Uh, they're little mini shotgun shells. I'm sure they're not cute when they're pointed at you, but uh, in the box they're pretty cute. So those are the uh, buckshot, and it actually on the box it shows a little picture of buckshot and then on the back of the box it actually says buckshot on there and it 12 is 12 gauge there's 20 shells in here um, and then the other one are lead slugs uh, and you can see even on the picture there's the lead slug uh, pooching out of there and you can clearly see the lead slug there uh, and again, these are 12 gauge. There are 20 in the box, and uh, they are one and three quarters inches long. So we're going to see uh, at the range, uh, probably go out to the range tomorrow, whether the DP-12 can handle this shorter shell uh, without any malfunctions. Uh, because if that's the case, you can put a whole lot more of these in there than you can of the two and three quarter inch shells. Uh, I think uh, I haven't done the math, but I think you could probably get um, instead of seven in each magazine you could probably get more like 11 uh, and then one in the one in the uh, chamber so you could probably have something like 24 rounds uh, of this as opposed to the normal 16 rounds in the DP-12 so it'll be interesting to see the only the only downside of these rounds is they are not inexpensive um, they are roughly uh, $19 for uh, the buckshot, so almost a dollar a round, and twenty dollars for the slug, so exactly a dollar a round. A little bit more expensive than their two and three quarter inch brethren, um, but you know if they're if you can fit a whole hell of a lot more in there, uh, it'll be worth the expense. So uh, we'll take it out to the range, and hopefully you'll stay tuned, and we'll see you there. Yep. All right, uh, we're gonna we're gonna give it a try with these uh, Aguila mini shells that are one and three quarter inches and see how it goes. These are the buckshot. Let's see how they load. Okay. Let's see. Yep. Okay. That's 12. So this right now is seven on each side. That will be the max with the two and three quarter inch. Let's see how many more go in comfortably. That's eight on each side. That's nine on each side. Okay, 10 on each side, so it clearly takes more. Let's see now. Let us see if we can rack it. Let's see how it, let's see if it loads in. Can you get a shot of that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, I believe it's loaded. Let's try to see how it goes and let's see how it shoots. All right, are we ready? Yep. Okay, it means it's hot.
safe. Well, had no trouble loading, had no trouble shooting. Looks like it did a pretty good job on the target. 20 rounds. All right, let's load up the slugs and see how we do. Okay, here is Luke shooting the Aguila uh, one and three quarter inch mini shell uh, uh, lead slugs. There's 20 loaded in the DP-12, and let's see how it goes. Safe it. Ooh, that smells uh, bad. Yeah, it smells bad. All right, so we had 40 shells, 40 of the mini shells, 20 slugs, and 20 buck. And you can see from the target, let me get a little bit closer here, that. Uh, Got a pretty good spread on that target, pretty good damage, zero misfire, zero failure to load. Uh, I'm going to have to say that the Aguila mini shells out of the DP-12 are a success. They allow you to fire uh, at least 20 shells, uh, and that's without loading two into the chamber and reloading. So I'm going to say you can get a minimum of 22, if not 24 in there, and uh, we don't have any failure to operate. So. I'm calling that a success. So we're back from the range uh, with the DP-12 and the Aguila mini shells. <clears throat> These are 12 gauge one and three quarter inch shell shells. Uh, here we have a combination of uh, buckshot on the bottom and uh, slugs on the top. And uh, we fired them out of the DP-12 double gauge pump action, uh, excuse me, double barreled pump action 12 gauge shotgun and <clears throat> my takeaway from this is that uh, number one uh, we didn't have any trouble loading the uh, mini shells and number two we fired off 20 rounds of buck and 20 rounds of uh, rifled slugs through the uh, DP-12 and we didn't have any failure to fire failure to load or failure to eject and we easily comfortably fit 20 shells inside and we certainly could have loaded two into the chamber and added an extra two so we, we could have fired at least 22 and I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that we, we could have gotten 24 in total so two in the chamber and uh, excuse me one in each chamber and 11 in each tube the normal capacity of this shotgun is seven in the tube and one in the changer, chamber or a total of, of 16 shots so this takes it from 16 shots uh, to probably uh, at least 22 if not 24 shots uh, and uh, as you can see from uh, when we fired in the on the range uh, the buck and the rifled slugs seem to have about the same effect as their uh, two and three quarter inch brethren uh, so I'm going to say I think that the uh, combination of the mini shells in the DP-12 uh, makes for a very uh, powerful uh, firearm with uh, just a ton of ammo uh, comfortably in there with minimal amount of recoil. The only comment I would make, uh, which would be a negative comment, is I'm not sure what they use for their uh, propellant, uh, but man, does it stink. Uh, when you fire these shells off, it makes a very unpleasant odor uh, that I don't get from uh, any birdshot, uh, buckshot, or rifled slugs that we've used before. Uh, we fired off wolf slugs, we fired off uh, fiocchi slugs, fiocchi uh, birdshot, uh, Fiocchi buckshot, <coughs> Suprema birdshot and buckshot, uh, Remington buckshot, and uh, uh, even Wolf uh, buckshot, and we haven't had any odor uh, other than the normal odor of firing guns, but whatever the hell is in the propellant in this Aguila mini shells is not pleasant. So uh, hold your nose, uh, but you'll have fun firing it. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video, and... Uh, if you have a DP-12, I highly recommend you get some Aguila shot shell yourself and uh, give it a shot. Uh, have a great day.